Glastonbury 2021 officially cancelled due to COVID pandemic. Glastonbury 2021 is officially cancelled, the festival's organizers have announced. With great regret, we must announce that this year's Glastonbury Festival will not take place and that this will be another enforced fallow year for us," organizers Michael and Emily Evis said in a statement. In spite of our efforts to move heaven and earth, it has become clear that we simply will not be able to make the festival happen this year. We are so sorry to let you all down. The event will not be rescheduled for this year. Information for ticket holders is available on the festival's website. We are very confident we can deliver something really special for us all in 2022," the Evises said. The decision came down to the wire. On 4 January, Emily Evis said there was no news and that the event wasn't cancelled, denying claims made by Spice Girl Mel B on BBC Radio 5 Live that it had been. Culture Secretary Oliver Dowden wrote in a statement, I share the disappointment of everyone that Glastonbury won't be going ahead this year. This regrettable but understandable decision is recognition that public health comes first. He said the government were looking at problems around getting insurance for festivals, with many organizers calling for a government-backed insurance scheme to help them continue to plan their events with greater confidence. Paul Reed, CEO of the Association of Independent Festivals, Glastonbury is not a member of AFE, wasn't surprised by the decision to cancel, which could have mixed ramifications for the rest of the British festival circuit. You have to consider its global and cultural significance, it's the largest greenfield festival in the world, and it could set the tone in terms of public confidence for festivals going ahead this year.